Hey, what's going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is The Real Legend, and we are back with some NBA 2K Mobile. And today, we will be ranking the top Galaxy Opal Foundation players in the game. It's been really exciting month for NBA 2K Mobile with the release of Galaxy Opals. As you can see on the screen, I got my first one, which was the Dominique Wilkins from the Dunkers theme. We also got the Pink Diamond Shaquille O'Neal as well. I will be telling you the best Galaxy Open players based off of stats, the best team based off of power, and what the max power will be for each of those players. Alright, so for your point guards, we're going to start from 5 and work our way up to number 1. Alright, so at number 5, we got Chris Paul. Number 4, we got Stephen Curry. Now, offensively, Stephen Curry is number 1, but when you look at all the stats for the game, I have to rank him a little bit lower. Number three is Gary Payton. That's five defensive stat is so great for getting easy steals and head to head. And he's a pretty complete player. Number two, we got Oscar Robertson. Previously, he would have been number one, but I have to admit he's a little bit slower this time around in season two. So I had to decrease him because the only way you can gain an advantage of it is if you have the right shoe that will bring up his speed. Number one is Russell Westbrook. In my opinion, he's very underrated in this game. A lot of people do not talk about how good he is. Very reliable mid-range shot. Excellent top of the key shot for head-to-head. -head. Very athletic. Insane layup package. Has the speed to back it up. Don't sleep on Russ. All right, so for the shooting guards, I want to start by saying every shooting guard in Galaxy Opal that is being named is elite. So if you get any one of them, you're in great shape. So number five is going to be Penny Hardaway. One of my favorite all-time players in NBA 2K Mobile. Number four is going to be Dwayne Wade, another incredible player to use. D-Wade's downfall is the lack of a strong three-point shot. That's what keeps him away from the other players. Number three is Kobe Bryant. Rest in peace always. Elite. If you have his pink diamond card from the Champions team, then you already know how incredible he is. Number two is going to be Michael Jordan. You might think I'm crazy, but trust me, number one is superior when it comes to gameplay in this game. Jordan is elite, very epic to use, incredible fadeaway, strong mid-range game. But number one is Tracy McGrady, the best player in NBA 2K Mobile when it comes to shooting guards. His package is crazy. Has an insane step back shot, a very crazy dream shake fadeaway type shot. He can dunk, he can shoot the three, very beautiful form. My favorite player inside of this game. For small forwards, at number five, we got Kevin Durant. And the small forwards are stacked. Trust me, I did not want to put Kevin Durant at number five because I think offensively, him and Larry Bird are the top small forwards when it comes to that. But I had to rank KD a little bit lower. His stats and his defense and rebounding aren't as good as the other players on his list. At number four is Kawhi Leonard. To me, he's like the Russell Westwood version for the small forwards. All around, great player. Number three is Elgin Baylor, rest in peace as well. Very solid gem in this game. Excellent all around stats. Number two is Larry Legend. A lot of people will argue he's the number one offensive small forward in this game. I cannot argue with that. Larry Legend has incredible range. Inside game is crazy. Post game is strong. Strong jump shot as well. Can't really say much more about Larry Legend. And then number one is LeBron James. He's the best player in the game. The stats support it. And his gameplay is very, very elite. All right, so for the power forwards, one of my favorite gems in this game, Omari Stoudemire. Just got his diamond for the Dunkers team and it's been fun to use him while I was grinding king of the court. Number four is Dirk Nowitzki. Definitely a fan favorite inside of this game. A lot of people like using Dirk on their squad. Number three is Kevin Garnett. My favorite power forward in NBA 2K Mobile. Very complete package. Great speed. Excellent mid-range shot. Strong on the pick and roll. He's definitely incredible. Number two is Anthony Davis. It's the brow, right? Very solid in this game as well. Excellent with the corner three. Always elite when it comes up on the list. And then number one is Giannis, has the best stats in the game. No one comes close to his stats when it comes to power forwards. Very dominant, just like Shaquille O'Neal. Strong rebounder, strong dunker. And in this game, he has a decent mid-range shot as well. Now for your centers, 
This was a bit of a tough one because there's a lot of really good centers. And I had to adjust some of the rankings based off of play style, based off of play style and what most players prefer to use on their teams, right? So I have to put Kareem Abdul-Jabbar at number five. All of these players' stats are similar, but Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, aside from the hook shot, right, which is almost unguardable in this game, he's very good at the block, good rebounder, but he doesn't have a mid-range or a three-point shot, and that really hurts when you're playing pick and roll or you're trying to hit the open shooter. Number four is Hakeem Olajuwon. My favorite center in this game, that dream shake is incredible. Hakeem is a little bit slower this year. I felt he was faster last year, but again, with the right shoes, he gets the job done. He is elite and is incredible. Next, we got Carl Anthony Towns. I had to rank him higher because he has a good three-point shot, very strong mid-range. He's everything that Hakeem could do, plus the jump shot. Marcus Cousins, a very underrated player in this game, really good stats, and he can do everything Carl Anthony Towns can do as well, but he, in my opinion, is a much more dominant dunker. And then the number one is Jokic. His stats are very elite, the best overall center in the game. He can do a little bit of everything as well. I think he's weak defensively, but he has a reliable jump shot, which is super important, really good on a pick and roll. He's a better rebounder in season three than he was in season two. So Jokic is pretty solid. So the top point guard based off of stats is Russell Westbrook. Top shooting guard is Tracy McGrady. Top small forward is LeBron James. Top power forward is Giannis. In the top center is Nikola Jokic. Now, if we look at power, very different list. So Stephen Curry will be a top point guard. His base power was 20,961. Maxed out, he's around 40,388. Shooting guard will be Michael Jordan. Base power is 21,906. Win max size is around 42,208. Small forward again is LeBron James. Base power is 21,889. Win max size is 42,176. Power forward again is Giannis. Base level is 20,853. Win max style is around 40,179. And last but not least, at your center position, we got Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Base level is 21,764. Win max style is around 41,935. So if you're lucky enough to get all five of those players on your squad, your team power will be around 41,277. So let me know in the comment section. What Galaxy Opal players have you pulled so far? Who do you have on your squad? Was one of your players listed in this breakdown? And how did your King of the Court grind go? As always, I appreciate all the support everyone's been showing on the channel. I catch everyone on the next one. Peace out.